Today's rescue is a microbat, and this is Master Maverick, as you can see by the size of my oops, sorry, size of my hands. He's very tiny. Anyways, about six grams. And he was found on the ground after reportedly flying into the side of the building, which is very odd because these tiny people do echolocate. He's actually buzzing in my hands, which is a warm-up to um, to flight. I can feel him vibrating. You're not going for a flight. You're going into a microbat carer tonight. But he may show you his teeth. I don't know. That formidable set of teeth. They use for munching um, and, and biting the, through the carapaces of insects. So very, very important to our environment. Lots of people don't even know about them because they're the sort of thing that you don't really see. If you see them at night, you'll think they're a little moth. But uh, they're not, are they, Maverick? No. He's calmed down a little bit. He was rather upset when he first came in this morning. Didn't you? Oh, whoa. See? See, he's got a little eye. So they can see, but they use echolocation to um, locate their prey. Beetles, flying termites, cockroaches, that sort of thing. And yep, I'm glad to see you've settled down a little bit. You're pretty cranky this morning. So he was rescued by Isabel this morning, and he's going home with the cat tonight. And she'll look after him until we know that he's okay. He does have a couple of little tiny holes in his wings, but apart from that, um, he looks pretty good. And then you can go home again. So they're released back to their home territory. And uh, to continue on with your important job in life. Let's hope so.